why I think hiring managers and HR and companies in general get it wrong when engaging with, with recruitment consultants, with recruitment agencies. Too often, people think that by engaging with a lot of people, a lot of agencies, five, six different companies to find their talent, that they're actually going to spread the market wider, that they're going to have better candidates, they're going to have a better coverage, because if you have five companies, mm -hmm. five um, consultants, then these five consultants, it's five times the work. But the reality is actually different. The reality is different. So if a company gives a consultant a contingency search, so they say, you can find somebody, and you're, if you're successful, we pay your fee. Mm -hmm. The problem is there, there's no commitment from the company, and there's also no commitment from the consultant. And what I mean by that is what the consultant will do, along with five, six, seven other positions they're trying to fill, is they're going to, as quickly as possible, try to find the easiest, uh, low-hanging fruit, as we say, the easiest candidates yeah. to find, the two, three best ones that they can find as quickly as possible, and those are the ones that they're going to show to the client. The problem is most recruiters, most consultants work in a very similar way. They've had similar trainings. So what does it mean? If I'm a good candidate, I've now got five consultants reaching out to me for the same job. And what does that give me as an impression of the organization? <laughs> Not really the, the, the best one. Mm -hmm. And that, that's one of the problems because everyone's searching in the same way. And they're doing it quickly because the commitment is not there. Now, if a company, if a hiring manager engages with a recruitment consultant on an exclusive basis, on a mandate, where there's commitment from both sides, they actually pay the same amount of money. But what they get is a highly, highly motivated recruitment consultant mm -hmm. because that person knows that they're gonna get paid for their efforts and they're not just gonna find the, the two, three easiest candidates. They're not just going to do a quick screening and, and, and do things as easy as possible. They really want to make sure that they fill that mandate because they want more mandates in the future as well. So I understand why hiring managers and HR people engage with many companies, but I think they're understanding perhaps at times, in my opinion, yeah. of how a recruitment consultant will then treat their position is wrong. So my advice to, to you or to, to companies in general would be to engage with consultants on an exclusive basis, on a mandate basis. Then they're going to go deeper in the search. Then a great candidate will only be approached by one person but in a very professional way mm -hmm. because they can afford to take the time because they're committed to you and you're committed to them. That's it.